Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams and I want to talk to you about the difference between a fixed and a variable cost. Being able to differentiate between fixed and variable costs is essential in any managerial or accounting um, situation. So we have fixed costs and these costs are costs that remain unchanged, fixed, in total as the activity base changes, but they change per unit. On the other hand, we have variable costs, which are costs that will vary, i.e. change in total in proportion to that activity base, but they remain fixed per unit. So let's take a look at an example. So we go out and we buy ourselves a car and now we have a car payment. Fixed or variable cost? Well, a car payment is a fixed cost associated with car ownership. So um, you go out, you buy a car and your car payment is $400 a month. Probably not getting that Lamborghini for $400 a month, but you can get something for $400 a month. And that car payment is going to remain fixed every single month. It's $400 a month, but let's say that we look at it and I say, I'm only going to drive my car 10 days. Remember we said that fixed costs remain fixed in total, but changed per unit based on activity our days that we drive is our activity. So now I can take that $400, look at it over a 10 day period, and it costs me roughly $40 a day to drive. But in the next month, I'm gonna take a cross country trip and I'm gonna drive 20 days. Well, my car payment is fixed but my activity base changed. Now I'm gonna drive 20 days and I can look at that and I can say, it only costs me $20 a day to drive because <clears throat> my car payment, my fixed cost remains fixed in total, but changes as my level of activity increases or decreases. Something that comes along with every car is maintenance. So is maintenance fixed or variable? Well, maintenance is a variable cost. So let's say that at your local Jiffy Lube, um, an oil change costs you $50. So every time you get your oil changed, it's $50. And that never changes. That's your per unit or per oil change cost. But we said that variable costs remained fixed per unit but changed in total. So this year you drive 12,000 miles. And if you follow the manufacturer's suggestion, you're going to change your oil every 3,000 miles. So that means that if I drive 12,000 miles and I change my oil every 3,000, it means I'm going to need to get my oil change four times a year. Each oil change costs me $50. So for that year, that variable cost of maintenance was $200. Again, I'm taking my cross-country road trip and I drive 24,000 miles in a year, and I still believe the manufacturer that I should change my oil every 3,000 miles, that's gonna require me to get my oil changed eight times. My activity has increased, but the cost of my oil change, my variable cost per unit, has remained fixed and now in total my variable costs are $400. So the 
per unit cost did not change. What, what did change was as my activity base increased or decreased, I know that my variable costs changed in total. As always, I hope that you found this useful and thanks for watching.